Hi, welcome to Ride Alongside. Today we are riding, well this is trail, trail 318. I'm coming up on trail 325, it's called Firewater. And it's one of the best trails in all of Prescott. It's in, it was in the latest version of the Whiskey Off-Road Race. And for good reason. All right, here it is. Trail 325, Firewater. And I know that my bell is super annoying to some, and I apologize for that. It's the Timber Mountain Bike Bell, which is the only bell I'll run because I can turn it completely off. I've got a review on it. It's called uh, One Year Review, $25 of Kindness. And the reason it is so annoying to some of you, and it's just clanging out like it is right now, is because hikers, dog walkers, equestrians, and other cyclists have told me countless times how much they appreciate me having my bell on. And they actually clear off the trail for me. So, um, you may find that if you run one on a downhill stretch like firewater like this, where you get going pretty fast, that People will already be off the trail for you. You won't have to wait for them. Now, there are exceptions to the rule, of course. There's people who can't hear very well and people with earbuds in, of course. But most hikers that know the trails where there's mountain bikers likely to be present <clears throat> will not be wearing earbuds because they know to listen for our hubs and for us clanging down the trail. But when they hear the bell, they know exactly what's going on, who's coming. So it's been a mutually beneficial situation. And although it annoys me, or it did at first, it's a lot better of a chime than you could get with uh, some other type of annoying bell. And it's way better than one of them ding ding bells because often you come around the corner like I'm about to and you cannot see if there's somebody below you or not. <clears throat> and this bell, I can turn it off and it's completely silent. So, I love that because there's some backcountry areas I ride where I don't have it on, where I haven't seen anybody for, I don't know, a few hours. And then there's trails like this where there's, it's a lot more common to see people. It's rare to see hikers on this trail, honestly, but I have seen them on occasion. And I've definitely seen other cyclists, so it's helpful. I know of actually quite a few people have had head-on collisions with other cyclists, and that's a huge bummer. <clears throat> this trail's kind of like Honey Bucket that I filmed a little while back, where it's fast and flowy in some sections, and it's got some technical to keep you on your toes keep you from getting bored, but I'm riding on the hard tail. Some people have asked when I shoot these point of view videos, first person view videos, whatever you want to call them, GoPro style videos. Like, Are you on the hard tail? Yeah, I am. Pretty much all I ride. I've ridden some full suspensions. I had a 
had a really nice tight end full suspension uh, two, about a decade ago. And uh, man, I could rail that thing pretty good. Nice boxy chain stays. But I prefer a hard shell in 80% of riding situations. This would be pretty fun on a full suspension though, I must say. Woo! A couple of these little drops. Some great rock work. The over the hill gang has done on this trail. Pretty nice having a, a trail work posse in your own town, just dedicated to building and fixing trails. <clears throat> Tell you, if you're retired and you don't do trail work, man, why not? Why not get on it? So most of those guys are um, they're retired. So here we go. That's the end of Firewater. Got the little creek here. And I'll show you where this ties into the Circle Trail. Right up here. The Havelina Trail 332. There's a little sign there. But um, Havelina Trail is part of the Circle Trail. There's the iconic fireplace. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, Firewater is one of my favorite trails. I really, really enjoy it. And if you come out to Prescott, you should try it out for yourself. And let me know if you're in town. Ridealongside at gmail.com. It's my email address. That's the best way to get a hold of me. So hit me up. I'm Nick from Ride Alongside. Thank you so much for watching. Coming to you from the Prescott National Forest. And I'll have more videos for you real soon.